uh, welcome again and this is my new project event hall booking system and i have developed this project in python django and mysql the version for the python i am using the python version 3.7 and mysql version is 5.6 and django version is 2 for connecting the mysql with python and django i am using the python mysql connector which you will get easily from the mysql.org website even if you are using the pip then you can install the py mysql in your system right using the pip so this is all about the server side technologies for front end it's a web based project so for front end i am using the html css and javascript some of the jquery library also have used like uh, form validations integration of the date plugins and many more things i have used the jquery plugin right so uh, this is all all about the technologies which i have used for developing this project event hall booking system right so let's start with the functionality go through so the project title is event hall booking system and it's a web-based mini python mysql dbms project right so this is the home page of the project it's a simple home page if you want to change the content then it gets directly from the html this is about and if you want to change the content of this about page then you can also change it from the html this is a search okay so from here you can search the uh, your event hall in which city you want to book this event hall just 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 search and what is the booking date right so once you click on the search it will show all of the halls which belongs to that city normally i have added halls only for the mumbai but if you want to add more halls then you can do directly from the database there is no admin panel for this project it's only and only customer panel so it's showing that okay for booking that you need to log in to book login to book right if you want to see the details just click on the see the details and you will be able to see the details of that hall right so for booking you can book, click on login to book and from here you can log in and you can book the hall right this is a login form from where you will be able to log in and see your own me see the customer dashboard this is the registration from where you will be able to register inside the website and through that user id and password you will be able to log inside the system this is a contact us page i am not saving the value of this contact us page anywhere into the database even i am not sending any type of email and sms from this page right so you can treat it as a simple static page right static form okay so now i am going to log inside the system so the user id is customer and the password is test so once you log inside the system you will get this event all in system dashboard from where you can see the dashboard so the same so the same menu will also be available here you can see so the, once you click on the dashboard this is the dashboard this is a search from where you will be able to search this is the all my bookings from where you will be able to get all of the bookings and you can see the view receipt section from here right even you can print the receipt too right now i am going to book the hall so this is the mumbai right and the booking date i am for the 25th so once you click on this you can check the details and after that you can book now click a you after getting the details click on the book now right so it's asking for your payment details and initial amount you need to pay is this one amount right so and you can enter any type of uh, card any type of details so i am not validating the things here right it's a simple uh, local host page means a so simple payment gateway page i am not uh, making any type of external transactions from this page right so no need to enter any type of correct credit card details so once you enter all of the information here just click on the make payment so once you click on the make payment you will get the your booking id is 14 and this is the information about your booking right you can print the receipt here right and this uh, booking details you can see in the my booking section also right this is a booking id 14 and once you click on the view receipt you will be able to get the details of that booking right the last thing is the logout so once you click on the logout then all the all of the user sessions will be destroyed and none of the administration menu means the customer administration menu will be displayed right so you can see this is the customer administration menu but once you log out then it's not showing but if you log inside the system it's showing the administration menu right so this is this menu is totally session driven and it renders according to the uh, user session right so this is all functionalities which i have developed inside the project that event hall booking system 
right but if you need more functionality in this budget just put it into the comment i will incorporate those changes i will make this budget more better and better according to your requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest budget videos on the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much